Alphaheim Studios presents Crock a Pancakes, a bedtime story by Jeanette C. Ehrenheim. Audiobook narrated by Emily Ehrenheim, Ellis Ehrenheim, and Dean Ehrenheim. Once there was a tricksy old crocodile named Fritz. Fritz lived in a cold, damp stream, which ran under a long, crooked bridge. The stream wound its way past a little green door that was attached to a big brick house. And in that house lived a clever little boy named John Isaac. Every Saturday morning, John Isaac would wake up to the smell of warm, buttery pancakes and crispy fried bacon. Excitedly, he'd rush downstairs and shout, Yay! It's, it's Saturday! We're having pancakes and bacon! Not only did this glorious smell fill the house, it floated out the little green door, down the cold, damp stream, under the long, crooked bridge, and into the nostrils of the tricksy old crocodile. And on this particular Saturday, his tummy started to growl for some warm, buttery pancakes and crispy fried bacon. But Fritz had a problem. Where would he get some pancakes? A few minutes later, as John Isaac was finishing his second stack of pancakes, he heard at the little green door. John Isaac stopped and thought to himself, Who's at my front door? Of course, John Isaac knew better than to open the door to a stranger, but he also wasn't tall enough to peek through the window of the little green door. So he asked, Who is it? It's your mailman, said the crocodile from the cold, damp stream under the long, crooked bridge. John Isaac loves to get letters and was just about to open the door when he thought to himself, Wait just a minute. Mailman doesn't come to breakfast time. So clever John Isaac took a couple Victoria magazines to stand on for another peek out the window of the little green door. He could see the very top of a head covered in green, scaly skin. John Isaac said, You look too scaly to be the mailman. Then Fritz tried again. It's your, um, grandmother. John Isaac loves to get visits from his grandmother and was just about to open the door when he thought to himself, She lives too far away to be here for breakfast. So clever John Isaac took a dictionary to stand on for yet another peek out of the window of the little green door. Now he could see a long, pointy nose. He knew it was not his grandmother. The nose was much too long. You're not my grandma, JJ. Who is this really? So the crocodile tried one more time. Well, it's your, your teacher. John Isaac was a clever little boy in thought. Would my teacher come to visit Saturday morning? So he grabbed a big, fat copy of Moby Dick to stand on for still another peek out the window of the little green door. He could see it wasn't the mailman. It wasn't his grandmother. It wasn't his teacher. Hey, I know who you are. You're the crocodile under the crooked bridge. You're right. I'm sorry I lied. I just really want some pancakes and maybe some bacon. John Isaac felt bad for the old croc, but remembered the fur family rule, no crocs in the house. But you're a crocodile, and crocodiles can't come into houses. Sorry, said John Isaac. Then, you know what Fritz started to do? He began to cry. Big, fat crocodile tears and in between tears he told john isaac 
Every Saturday, I can't smell your pancakes and bacon. All the way back to my cold, damp stream under the long, crooked bridge. And it smells so good. I never get pancakes and bacon. John Isaac thought for a moment and said, why don't you go over to the Crocodile Cafe? And as the sniffle stopped, the tricksy old crocodile said, oh, I, I never thought of that. That's a great idea. As he left the little green door on the big brick house to get his pancakes and bacon at the Croco Cafe, he said to John Isaac, Thanks. See you later, alligator. And John Isaac said, Off the wild crocodile! The end. This is Emily Ehrenheim. We hope you have enjoyed this production of Croco Pancakes by Jeanette Ehrenheim. This program was produced and directed by Dean Ehrenheim. Print copy edited by Jared Ehrenheim and illustrated by Trevor Ehrenheim. Recorded in part at Betaheim Studios. Text copyright 2021. Pending.